Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tina and if you're new here, hi, I'm also new here. <laughs> we haven't been on this channel for like a year. It's been a minute. It's been a hot minute. Do you know what? Life can be a lot. we talk about i don't know i'm also new i don't know what you guys talk about here look last year we were talking about people moving to the uk as healthcare assistants that did well for a while i also shared my journey with you guys of how i left adventism to this day every time like comments come up on that video it gives me anxiety because it was a tough thing for me to do even though i was sure that god wanted me to do it it was a tough thing for me to do and that gave me that made me afraid a little bit but you know what 2024 we're not gonna be afraid i like to take it easy i don't try like to do too much like in the beginning of the year because i don't want to get that you know february burnout and i again feel like i'm failing so i ease myself into the year and that has kind of worked for me for the few years that i've kind of done it where i take it easy into the year and not try to change way too much into my life because actually i do believe in new year new me resolutions yada 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 i believe in all of that because i also believe that nothing changes if nothing changes so when the year ends and you know that we conclude things um we close chapters and we look forward to this new blessing that god has given us which is a new year to start afresh with him you know um the bible says his new his mercies are new each morning and i feel like his mercies are also new each year with each new year you get new blessings and for me and my family we always pray for our portion for that year we obviously pray for our daily bread our daily portion but we also pray you know when a new year starts we also just pray for our blessings for that year god is really good i saw the hand of god in my life in 2023 and i hope you guys did as well and i hope your vision boards and your prayer boards i really call it a prayer board for 2024 is ready and you're just ready to receive god's blessing for 2024 i also like reflecting on the past year i know a lot of people get to do that in december i didn't i had a really amazing december we had family we had so much fun it was fun but i didn't get time to just sit back and reflect on the year that i just had and i'm so glad that i can sit here and say god was so good to us god was so good to me and my family throughout 2023 for literally right from the beginning to the end of 2023 life was just god was just so consistently good as he is but to be able to look back and say wow 2023 was an amazing year that is such a blessing for me to be able to say that it got a bit funny though towards the end it got a bit weird but i also now am at a place where i understand that god was trying to teach me something because i'm at a point in my life now where I, I i really really try and i almost always trust god that he's leading and he's directing me and everything that's happening in my life is according to his will so when some things aren't happening according to how i would want them to do to go i usually ask myself and say what is God trying to communicate to me in this time? And what lessons are in this for me? And I remember listening to one of my favorite podcasts and this person in there said, unmet expectations can be a blessing, you know? And I, I remember just resonating with that so much in that, in that moment and realizing that what I was going through was God setting me apart. I, I struggle with rejection and when I feel like I've been rejected that was it was it was just like a weird one right and and I remember thinking God has set me apart I know that and if there are people that can't go with me where I where God is leading me to go I can't be upset at that 
for them and for myself and just knowing that I'm trusting God to lead me even though there are people that I would always want to take with me in my life where I want to go if it's not happening it's not God's will and it took me a really long time to come to terms with that but when I eventually did I found peace in God I always always find peace in God and his word and his promises that I know are true for me and my life I also had to learn that my identity is in Christ I am only who God says I am so yeah 2023 ended a bit funny but I can still stand here and say hallelujah God is good you know so yeah I don't know it's been a lot of rambling obviously because it's my first video in a while I'm feeling a bit nervous but one of my goals for this year is obviously to try to be consistent with this channel because I love this. It is nerve wracking sitting in front of her. Well, I recall using my phone and just talking to the air and myself. But then again, I, I like to talk. I've got things to say and I've got good things to say. Hopefully God's also using me to s spread his word and his love through this platform and which is why i started the channel anyway we're going to continue obviously talking about whatever we we're talking about last year every now and again we'll throw in a video about moving to the uk if there's anything that i feel like i need to share i will probably share i will also maybe share a few more aspects about our life i mean we have since moved to a different house um it's always like a, a learning curve you know like we're we're not or we're, we're starting afresh so there's always stuff happening life is always lifing because life will always lies forgive me for abandoning my channel and i hope you guys will continue to support me the way you did last year when i started this channel yeah i hope you know i hope you guys and whatever you're doing in your personal life are setting intentions for your year are praying to god so he can show you where he needs you to be i know there's a lot of people here that follow me that are trying to come to the uk as healthcare assistance just dedicate your plans to the lord if it is his will for you girl why not why not so let's continue to grow in christ together let's continue to grow as human beings together and I hope to see you in my next video. If you've even watched this video this far, because it was a ramble, right? Thanks. Thanks. God's about to do amazing things in your life. Thank you very much.